All right, so let me ask you this. So <laughs> what do you, how would you, Stephen, you're the review expert, how would you go about obtaining or anything about like getting that review or just a simple two, one, two sentence answer. How would you get reviews for a company, guide them and or yourself? Well, I think the biggest reason people don't give reviews is because they don't know what to say. And so my suggestion would be, you know, there's, there's a couple different, you know, overarching principles that you should use. One, be specific. Um, pick that one thing that really sticks out to you from that product or service that you're giving the review to um, and tell how it affected you, you know, how, how it related to you personally, um, because that's the second part is, is be personal. So be specific and be personal. Tell how it affected you. Uh, if you were searching online for that product and service earlier, what information were you searching for in the reviews? Because if you bought something, especially if you bought it online, you looked at the reviews. You looked to see if it got a four star, five star, the ones that were two stars and three stars, you were looking to see what brought that product or service down. So what information would you be looking for if you were searching this business um, online? So be specific. Pick that one thing out and be personal. How it affected you. This is probably the most important one that you can answer. Correctly. Okay, so I can do this. What is the best way to get started with fresh focus marketing? Call me maybe. It's a good one. <laughs> the best way would the best way to get, connect with fresh focus marketing is obviously go to freshfocusmarketing.com. You see a little search bar somewhere pop up. Does it pop up now? It, it does. If it's the first time you've gone there, it'll it'll pop up before you leave the website. What if they leave and come back? Sounds like dinner or... They, well, there's at the bottom kind of in the really footer, there's it. another link to it. Where they get there and go, yeah, I don't think so. And then they're like, no, no, I should do it. Where's it at? It's on the bottom. Bottom of the page. Link, link on below. The link below. And, you know, you click there and fill that out, and that, kind of, that will give you the starting points of the of the whole process, the audit, the breakdown, uh, show your business ranks, the average versus competitors, how you rank in keyword searches, uh, your NAP, which is? Name, address, phone number is the same across all yeah. of your citations. It's important for them to be the same. Like if you just have even like Cincinnati spelled out in one place and C-I-N-T-I in another place, it, it's it's not good. You may say to yourself, it's not that important. What camera's working? Why wouldn't you want to give yourself all the advantages that you could possibly get? It'll show you your online reviews, uh, if your Google My Business is optimized, and if you're easily found on certain channels. So go to freshfocusmarketing.com and fill out the little free local SEO report. That's good.